In today's video, I'll be making and tasting a seven pound chicken nugget. Ronald McDonald ain't got shit on me. Checking out what could be the biggest tiny holiday gift this year, the grocery gang, and more things you guys dared me to do in the comment section. Jumping right in, you guys dare me to make the world's biggest chicken nugget. So I cleaned out my local grocery store of all their ground chicken and made the biggest chicken nugget you never want to eat. If I die of food poisoning in the near future, you'll know why. For this next challenge, you guys dare me to make the biggest chicken nugget I possibly could. So I went to the store and completely cleaned out their ground chicken. And I mean completely cleaned them out. There was absolutely none left by the time I was through. I don't even know if I can make all this into one chicken nugget, but I am going to try my heart out. I'm really excited to do this. I've seen a lot of people attempt this, but I'm gonna be trying a little bit of a different method this time. I'm gonna have to use a giant punch bowl for mixing this stuff. And then I'm gonna show you how you can solve all your problems with shake and bake. Or more like some generic kind of shake and bake. I also want to give a big shout out to our sponsor Grocery Gang. They make these toys which are small miniature versions of gross food and they're really fun to play with. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing. Oh my god, this is absolutely hilarious. I could totally bounce these off the wall. These would be fun to play with. Looks like you could even stick them on the end of a pen. But the reason why I like this one a lot, I think this one is a blue waffle. I'm pretty sure that they gave me blue waffles. That is hilarious. And they give you a surprise grocery in the milk crate. I love surprises. This is gonna be awesome. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. I'm just gonna set out my grocery gang and let them watch and marvel as I cook this gigantic chicken nugget. All right, let's get this thing going. First things first, I need to start tearing open some chicken. And since this is in honor of the grocery gang, I figured washing my hands is not gonna be necessary. Does that look like enough to make one chicken nugget? Absolutely not. The only things I'm gonna add to this, a little all-purpose seasoning, cayenne pepper, and just a dab of salt. Does this look gross to you yet? It will. While that nasty nugget is doing its thing, I wanted to just thank our sponsor, The Grocery Gang. And by the way, this toy is blowing up right now. You can get all 150 of these little guys and I'm definitely gonna try. Plus, it's a pretty cool gift for the holidays. I left a link to their website in the description. Now I'm gonna try to form an actual nugget out of this. This next part's easy, grease up the pan. And wouldn't you know it, it looks like maybe there is enough room for a little bit more nugget. Oh, looks like I'm getting the grocery gang a little bit grosser down here. Now I'm just gonna basically try to form it into a nugget as best I can. I'm gonna cook this side first, and then I'm gonna flip it and get the other side. That's my plan. That's how we're gonna get away with making a nugget this big. Fingers crossed. Now I have to wash all of this off of my hands somehow. An easy way to make the breadcrumbs stick to your giant chicken nugget is to use egg. Smother the chicken nugget in egg and then put the breadcrumbs on. I like to go a little bit overboard with my breadcrumbs. All right, well, we're almost there. I'm gonna give it a little bit longer and- What I didn't know was that this thing was gonna take all freaking night to cook. Looks like it needs a few more minutes, but we're getting closer at least. It's starting to get brown around the sides. All right. Still don't know if that's exactly ready to get flipped yet. I really don't want this thing to come apart while I'm trying to flip it. All right, now we have officially gotten to the point where I don't give a fuck if this thing is done yet or not, because I'm pulling this out. Only I forgot that it's like 45 pounds. Okay, and it's burning me. I need two hands to pull this out because that's how heavy it is. This is seven pounds of chicken nugget. Now here's the real test. I have to cut it open to see how the middle is cooked. I don't know. So I just cut this thing open. It's steaming hot right now. I'm not really sure if this thing is safe to eat. This is really borderline. I, I think that it's cooked. I think that it's done. I'm gonna definitely try to eat some. The grocery gang over here holding it down, they're still loving it. I really hope that I don't get food poisoning from eating this. Here it is. This is the world's biggest chicken nugget. As far as I'm concerned, this is the creme de la creme of all chicken nuggets everywhere. This thing is the biggest monster. It's a seven pound chicken nugget. There's no way I could ever possibly eat this in one sitting. I don't think that I could eat this in seven sittings, but I will take a few bites out of it just to taste the masterpiece that it is. I may have spoken too soon, but we'll, we'll see. That tastes like a chicken nugget. I cut it apart just to see if it was cooked on the inside. I'm really kind of wishing that I had left it together now. Where's a bucket full of barbecue sauce when you need one? You know what I mean? You know what? All the seasoning I put in it, it really doesn't even need it. 
Looks like I'll be eating chicken nugget well into next year. But who am I kidding? That's probably what I would have been eating anyways. Now I just have it all at once. Guys, I swear to God, my arms are already getting tired holding this thing. It's so ridiculously heavy. To consider that one chicken nugget is just, that's absurd. I, I can't, I can't even. My arms are gonna fall off. That thing is so heavy. I'll probably need an entire roll of tinfoil to wrap this thing up. After that, we'll be on to the next dare. And I'm always up for a good challenge. So leave me your dares in the comment section. Make sure to like the video. Subscribe if you get to have done that. All right, thanks guys. Bye.